This is Ruby. Ruby is a lab and she's about two years old. So in lab years, that's a very young lab. So she's a very energetic girl. Yes, aren't you? And you like your treats? Yeah. So she's still, still in the learning stages. So uh, she sits very nicely. Starting to learn down. But she will jump up quite a bit still. Let's jump up on you. Which is not the best trait to have, is it? But you're working on that. Yeah, you're smart. You'll master it. Ah, oh, Ruby. Yeah. Can you look, look right there for everybody? Yeah? Right here, you see that? <laughs> yes. You just want to go for a long walk, don't you? Burn up some energy. Good girls. Can you sit? There's that nice sit. Good job. This is Canelo. Canelo is about four years old, and he is a Chihuahua, short-haired Chihuahua and Dotson mix. And he's a little shy to start out with, but he warms up pretty quickly. Yeah. So Chihuahuas have high energy level. For a little doggy, they're very high energy level, but they generally will have little spurts of high energy and then mellow out for the rest of the time. So as long as you can get up some good hard play time about four or five times throughout the day, you know, a little burst of about, you know, 15, 20 minutes, they're good to go, aren't ya? So because this guy's a little shy on the shower side, we're recommending him with children above nine years old. He's a little dog selective and no cats because he'll probably want to chase them, so. We don't want to put them through that. Yeah, what a good boy. Can you up? Oh, good job. Yeah. What a good boy you are. Yeah. Good job, Canelo. Canelo. Yeah, good job. So this is Paula. Hi, Paula. And Paulo will be the dog of the week this week. So this is Paula. Paula is a seven year old. Adhesion Ridgeback Lab Mix. Hey, sweeties. You want a treat? You do like your treats, don't you? Good babies. So she is recommended in a household with some older kids, so 13 and up, because she is older and she's uh, getting a little bit weaker in the back end and might not like you know, too much overhandling by smaller kids. Hey sweeties, yeah. Huh, Paula? Yeah. You want a treat? You want to smell, don't you? You want to go smell things? Mm hmm. You want to go check things out? This is about her normal stroll speed right here. So she'll, uh, still very mobile. She'll go for smaller strolls with you, but no extended long walks. She just likes to get out and sniff things, get some stimulation. She is a big girl, she's about 101 pounds. Paula came in as an owner surrender. Her real name when she came in was Pup, P-U-P, which wasn't uh, very descriptive, so we named her Paula. Yeah. So this is a golden retriever, and came as a stray a few days ago on the 3rd. So he's not quite our dog yet, so if you do know an owner that's missing a golden retriever, we're guessing at about a 12 year old, and he's a male. Hey sweeties, yeah. You like your treats, don't you? Right here, right here, there you go. Good boy. Seems to be pretty gentle natured. Don't know too much about him yet, because he is new to the shelter. 
Yeah, good boy. Yeah. He's a good boy. Yeah. Someone's got to be missing you, huh? Yeah. So if you're missing your dog, or if you know somebody that is missing a golden, send them on down to Clappers County Dog Services. Get them reunited. Yeah, I know, sweeties. Yeah. A good baby. Yeah. So this is Maya. Maya is about a one-year-old, and she is a Border Collie mix. And uh, she just got spayed recently. That's why she has a nice necklace on, which you don't think is that nice, do you? Yeah, you'd rather not have that, huh? Yeah. So she's a youngster, so she's got a lot of energy to burn. Yeah, don't you? Yeah. You look right there. Show everybody how cute you are. Yeah. Yeah, beautiful markings. So if you are a jogger, she'd probably be a really good match for you. Because she is a fast little girl. Yeah, aren't you? Yeah, you like to chase the ball. Sometimes you'll bring it back for me. But we gotta wait until you get your head cone off to do that some more, huh? Yeah. Like a girl. Yeah, look right there. Yeah. Yeah. What a pretty girl. Yes, you are. You take it pretty gently, too, don't you? Yeah. Oh, I heard that. Yeah. What do you think? So she's kind of a medium-sized dog, so... If you're looking for that medium-sized dog, she might be a good match for you. Yeah. As long as you're up for that high-energy dog. Can you look right there? Yeah. Show them those big, beautiful brown eyes. You yeah, good, baby. Good job. Can you sit? Oh, that's a good sit. That's very good. Yeah. And you're starting to learn the down before the head cone, huh? It's kind of hard with that on. Yeah. All right, Maya. We'll see you later. Yeah. You can eat cookies all day, couldn't you? All right. So this is Nova. Nova is six months old. And she is an American pit bull mix. Yeah. Hey, girl. What you doing? Huh? You want that? So she's pretty recent to the shelter. She's been here a little less than a week. Yeah. Hey, baby girls. Can you sit? Do you know sit yet? <laughs> nope. You know up, huh? All right. Well, things to work on, huh? What do you see, huh? I mean, yeah, you're only six months old, so you got lots of time to learn, huh? Wanna try again? Yeah. Can you sit? Can you sit? You're thinking about it. Can you sit? Oh, you're almost going down. Oh, good girls. There you go. Good girls. Yeah. <laughs> you're a loud little chewer, aren't you? And these are little small pieces, too. Oh. It's all gums right now. Good girls. Can you look right there? Yeah. Good girls. Gotta chew. <laughs> Good job. You cleaned up. Yeah. Yeah, I've had you out walking. You're a little bit of a puller still. Got some leash training to do, don't ya? Yeah. Good job. It's all about the treat, huh?
this little one is about eight months old and we just recently named it Tonka and it's been here about the same time as Nova I believe they actually came in close to the same date, if not the same day. You drew the same two good six. Yeah. This is a Bundle American Pit Bull Terrier mix. How about you? Can you sit? Can you sit? Oh, good sit, good sit. Oh, good job. Good job. So you got the basic down, huh? You got the sit down, nice. Good sit. Yeah, so you're a little bit bigger than the other one, huh? Yeah, I know. Both learned how to chew at the same place. Yeah, you're both loud chewers, huh? What you doing up here? Yeah. Think the treats are better up higher, huh? Is that it? Can you look right there at everybody? Yeah. Whoa. Too much work. Yeah. Can you sit? Can you sit again? Oh, the good set. Oh, the good set. Good job. Yeah. Good babies. I don't think I've had you outside yet, huh? Yeah. That's good stuff, huh? Oh, the good set. Good job. You learn quick, don't you? Oh, good job. <laughs> chomp, chomp, chomp. Chomp, chomp, chomp. Yeah, is that good? Yeah, that's good stuff. Keeps the tail wagging. Good doggy. <laughs> You're getting faster, but you're eating it, huh? Look at that. It's gone in two seconds. Okay, little Tonka. Yeah. Up here making somebody smile out there, huh? Yeah. Okay, this one just came in today on the 5th. And it has an American Pit Bull Terrier mix. And it's around two years old. And it looks like it came in from Southeast 170th and Hazel Street. So if you know anybody that's missing a dog from around that area, let them know. Come on down to Clackamas County Dog Services. This is an intact male. Yeah, an estimating at about two years old. You sit nicely, don't you? Yes, you like your treats too, don't you? You take them nice and gently. Yeah, what a good boy. Good job. And he came in with a harness on. And it was a gray harness. And he's roughly about, looks like, 61 pounds. Hi, thank you for your kisses. So he's a very nice size American Pit Bull Terrier, aren't you? Yeah, it's right about what you should weigh. Yes, I know, I know. What do you think, huh? Yeah. Stay, keep the treats coming. Yeah. I like my treats. You know how to shake? Can you shake? Can you shake? Really you were thinking about it, huh? Probably could without the pants. Yeah. This one here is a Pomeranian, and it's a youngster. It's about a year old, and we recently named this one. Someone got creative, it looks like, Mayor Fluffington. Are you a Fluffington, huh? You like treats? Oh, yes, you like your treats. So this one uh, came in on about the 31st. So we haven't quite done an assessment on it, but this dog became ours today. We still need to do some assessments on it. 
before it's up for adoption, so it's not quite up for adoption yet. And I'm kind of surprised no one came and reclaimed you. So if you do know anybody that's missing a Pomeranian, a youngster, yeah, send him our direction. He's a very cute one, aren't you? He is a male, an intact male. Yeah, I know. This one likes to jump up in the lap. Very easy on a leash. And you look like you really like your treats. Yeah, you got a good appetite, huh? Very fluffy. Yeah. You got springs, don't you? You got little springs for legs, huh? Yeah. Cute, aren't you? Yeah. I should say handsome because you're a boy, right? Yeah. Okay, Flump Fluffington. Yeah. Okay, and this little one here is a young female American Pit Bull Terrier, and she just came to us today as a stray, so she's really new to the shelter. So if you do know anybody that's missing the little blue-eyed little female pity, send them our direction. You're so gentle. Did you not like what I gave you? I think you spit it out, didn't you? Not, not, not the right flavor, huh? I'll try again. Nope, not your flavor. <laughs> so this one came in off uh, Larkin Road and Buccaneer Creek Road out in Beaver Creek. Yeah, what do you think? I know. Not quite home, is it? Yeah. Are you missing your home, huh? up. Show off those pretty blues. Yeah, those are pretty blue eyes. You actually ate that treat, huh? So you like them a little bigger, huh? Is that it? Alright, so this one came in on the 4th, and it's a Pekingese, and uh, it does have a chip, and its name is Bentley. And we're still waiting to see if the owners will come and reclaim the dog at this point. And it came in off of Southeast Sunnyside Road in Clackamas. Want a treat? You don't want that treat? No? Yes. There's a lot of Pekingese lovers out there. You're awful cute. And that smushed up little face of yours, huh? How oh, Bentley? What do you oh, think? Yeah. Are you a cutie? Yeah. You don't like my treats, huh? There you go. Oh, yeah, spit it out. Look right there. Oh, what's that? Good job, Bailey. So this is Domino. Yes. Hey, boy. And he is a lab, and he is about 10 years old. He's a senior guy. Yeah. Looking for your senior retirement home, aren't you? Yeah. But he's still got a nice pep in his step, don't you? You still like to go walking? Yeah. He's a little nervous in here. Huh. It's not your favorite place to be. You'd rather be cuddled. Cuddled up on the couch, hanging out with your people. 
Yeah. There's a nice look at you, huh? Good boy. Yeah. You like your treats, don't you? So he does have a little bit of arthritis going on, probably in the back end. Getting up there in the years. So he needs a just nice, mellow, relaxing home. Somewhere where there's no little kids. Yeah. Because they might pull on your tail or something like that. And no kitties, because you probably chase them or don't know what. Yeah. He does pretty good with other dogs. He is a little selective on some dogs. Uh, if you have another dog, bring him in for a meet and greet. 